Hi, my name is Jesse Montagna. I'm the founder of the AMP Project, Adult Men for Paramore. We're a group of adult men who are still devoted to the band Paramore, despite our demographic being outside the norm for emo pop punk culture. You know, we're fathers, husbands, blue, white collar workers, you name it. Uh, but we still love to get down to the music that made our hearts sing back when we were teenagers. As I kept following the band in my earlier years, I noticed as I got older, uh, I didn't exactly fit in with the aesthetic that was around me. I guess you could say I started to shop at the Gap while the people around me were more into the Hot Topic sort of thing. Uh, soon enough, I began to notice I wasn't the only old dude in the crowd. <laughs> I guess it's not too hard to spot us in a sea of purple-haired teenagers, but uh, after meeting some other adult men at the shows who weren't just fathers chaperoning their daughters, conversations about Paramore started to happen outside the venue as well, and uh, I guess those chats turned into what we know of AMP as today. Who knew? Uh, I guess my love for Paramore started out like any other fan would have, you know. I was in middle school at the time, and uh, we were playing the video game Rock Band. I was on bass, naturally. <laughs> and uh, the song, That's What You Get, popped up on our set list. And you could say it was love at first drum. <laughs> Yeah, you know, after we finished the song, I couldn't get enough of it. And I guess that's when my love for that iconic Paramore sound started. You know, as the song says, that's what you get when you let your heart win. <laughs> so, uh... The, uh Paramore poster. Yeah, you know, I kept up with them. And uh, as they grew up, I grew up too, of you course. See, and, uh, much. before you know it, uh, you're, uh... You an adult man fighting for the front row in a sea of teens and tweens uh, singing misery business live in concert. So. I think the hardest part is not the age gap or getting dirty looks from parents. I think the hardest part really is just making someone believe you when you tell them Paramore is still your favorite band. You know, and not just their hits, you know, literally everything about them. Paramore shirt. You see, Paramore to me is more than music. The singles club. Paramore's changed my life, truly. They've given me hope and courage. They've given me a reason to smile after sadness. A reason to wake up in the morning after a tough night. Paramore is a reason to believe in love and joy. When everything else in life seems to prove otherwise. You see, to me, Paramore is the reason. Period. They're the reason to say yes. To believe in yourself and believe in others. And because they've given me so much reason in my life, I can't help but try and return the favor and hope that because a full-grown adult man like myself still loves their music and who they are, they have a reason to keep being Paramore. Plus, I still play rock band, so. Believe it or not, believe it or not, this right here was gum that uh, Haley Williams chewed on stage. She spit it out, I actually picked it up after she spit it out into the crowd. So, uh, it's pretty cool. Oh, man. <laughs>